Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Ferdinand Holum. Hi everybody, welcome back and a very good Saturday morning to you. After several days of cooler below average temperatures, even mist and drizzle and low clouds and fog, yeah, things are starting to change a little bit here. Uh, today's kind of the transition day as high pressure is starting to build in for a warming trend. Here's a beautiful time lapse this morning from Monterey, the Portola Hotel and Spa, just at about sunrise. Sunrise this morning, right around seven o'clock. There go the boats out going fishing out there. Just a beautiful morning. And now here is a live view from the same shot. Again, a little bit of haze out there, but no low clouds, no fog, lots of sunshine, a little bit cool this morning. Any fog? Well, offshore, way, way, way offshore here. We're not going to see the fog here for a while, actually, here, at least for the next, uh, well, I mean, the marine layer has a mind of its own sometimes, don't get me wrong. Uh, but nonetheless, right now, it looks like we're going to be done with the low clouds, at least for about a good week or so. 40s right now, so pretty chilly at the coast, even inland. Look at Gilroy, 45, Hollister, 49, Salinas, 45. There you're a little weak offshore winds there, anywhere from zero to about three miles per hour. That'll be the trend over the next several days. And when we get the offshore winds, we get the warming conditions here. So exiting area of low pressure brought us the cool temperatures. That's scooting out that way. Ridge of high pressure starting to build in. And again, fall time, we get the cool nights, a lot of 40s out there, and then Warm temperatures with 80s by the time we get into the midweek there, even even some uh, low 90s. Here's our microcast again. Look at these arrows over here. Going to get offshore or more north, northeasterly or so. But then by the afternoon, of course, the sea breeze kick in and they battle a little bit. Still offshore, onshore at the coast. So again, uh, at the coast, moderated temperatures. By the middle of next week, we'll see temperatures getting into the 80s at the coast. Not even out of the question. We could even see a couple low 90s at the beaches. I haven't put those on the eight day yet, but 80s for sure. Uh, 70s around the San Francisco Bay today, so lovely up there. Sunshine for everybody. San Jose, 78, low 80s down the Santa Clara Valley. Hollister pushing 80 degrees down the Salinas Valley. Beautiful, super comfortable temperatures. Salinas, 71. Soledad, 75. King City, 77 degrees on the Monterey Peninsula. Again, where you got the sea breeze, keeping temperatures moderated, middle to upper 60s. For today, of course, Carmel Valley and Big Sur, just a skosh warmer in the mid 70s. Santa Cruz pushing 80 up in the hills. In town, 76. Watsonville, 74. Beautiful day up in Santa Cruz. Beaches, anything you want to do outside today. Here's your KSPW eight day forecast. So look at this, uh, 60s and 70s here through Monday. And then there are your 80s, 82, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, warmest days. And we even keep that going into the weekend. And for inland, there's your warming trend. Monday and Tuesday, mid 80s. There are your 90s there for Thursday and into next weekend. So again, we are in this uh, time of year, fall. The calendars changed pages yesterday. So we're feeling the very much fall like. It's funny how weather cooperates with the seasons right. sometimes, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice though. I I'm enjoying this, this fall weather. <laughs> I, you should enjoy it. Thanks, Ray. Yeah.